Yo guys, it's your boy Peter. It's another one, man. So on today's video, man, we're gonna be talking about how to trade Forex using Metro Twitter 5 on a desktop, guys. I'm not talking about mobile phone. If you want that, you can watch other videos regarding mobile phone. But this time we're talking about your forex trading, man, from logging into your trading account into using the Metro Twitter 4 Trader 5 to trade Forex. So here we go, it opens, it pops up, it's still a fresh, fresh, fresh trading terminal. I haven't done anything on this terminal. So if ever you're interested in opening up um, an account, as you can see, this is a derive uh, broker, but I always recommend Xness. You can always download anything from Xness. You can download the trading platform from Xness from your local broker, or just simply go to the MetaTrader and say, uh, MetaTrader download uh just like here if i show you say meter trader download it will definitely 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 uh give you options like meter trader 5 download and once you click on it you can definitely go to any broker that you like and download meter trader but it's always best to get it from the meter trader or any trusted global broker you know so things doesn't get anywhere for you so for me uh, the brokers that I'm going to be using, uh, it's Xness. And people don't realize that you don't need a trading terminal from Xness in order to trade on that terminal alone. So for now, I'm just going to be using Xness and the uh, trading terminal from the Rev. And just like that, I'm just going to search for Xness on this trading terminal and Xness is going to pop up. I'm just going to go ahead and select Xness Technologies and say next. And just like that, I have options to log into my trading account. And of course, just gonna go for 980. This is my login ID, guys. So bear with me. And you would have already opened an account if ever like you want to reach this stage. And on that account, it consists of an account and a password. And I'm just going to go ahead and select the server of which this account is based on. And with that, just say, voila, I've logged in into my trading account. And that's it. And yes, you can have multiple accounts logged into the same terminal. As you can see now, here we've got your market watch. And here at the top, we've got our trading tools, algo trading how to open orders, how to access meter code language editor, and the rest symbols if you want to look at the symbols and manage profiles, and then uh, there to create a new chart if you wanna chart a new window. But you can also definitely do it like this. Uh, don't forget about that. You can right click next to the currency that you want and just like that. You have it and over here I've got the one tick clicking trading or you can just access everything if you open a chart and right click on the chart you get one click trading and then you've got what your indicator list if ever there were any indicators here expert list candlestick time frames your templates and everything like this is important if you want to change time frames and everything just like now and uh, I'll show you how to see which time frame you are at at uh and then uh if you want to remove the grid or you want the like the if you want the terminal to auto scroll or shift your chart you can just click that in order to shift the chart so that you can see things clear and you also got your zoom in zoom out buttons which of course you also have here at the top and the shifts and everything you also have there at the top and here you've got your study stuff study materials and the view itself if you go to view, view controls your market watch, controls your navigator, controls your toolbox. If ever like you don't see any of these things displayed here, you can always access them through view. And with that being said, guys, so if you also want to remove, you can just go out to view and remove your toolbox, navigator, as well as your market watch. And you've got your chart alone like that, but I like to keep it. Uh, navigator navigator just simply shows you things like your account uh your indicators that you need your expert advices that you might have you'll see when we get to the installation stage when we talk about installing man of worth on your meter trader 4 meter trader 5 
and then your script your services your market this stuff is based on us like for me you know i'm a retail expert advisor seller you can also get other people who are selling their system from the market as well it's reliable it's safe just like for villa do does and if ever into signals you can opt for that but i'm not here to talk about that i'm just gonna have to help my clients talk about how to trade forex using major trader for and you can open the navigator as well and you can open the toolbox as well so with the market wide this is where you get all your currencies your, your your financial instrument that you're interested into trading so now i'm just gonna go ahead and hide all and a good thing about the middle trader five if ever like this anything that you don't you don't find or any market instrument that you're interested in but you don't find you can just simply search it right there just like gold you can just spell the abbreviated uh letters for it just like zao usd you can find it like euro usd uh you can find it and then just press enter and just click and just type those name great britain pound usd just like that unlike the meta trader 4 where you have to right click and just go to uh symbol itself and just try to navigate there one by one but it's also a cool thing you can also do that you just added multiple features in order to you know to navigate easily and stuff like that so but here you can also click like that and add btc usd into your market wise just like that and if ever like this any market you also want to add just right click and just go to it and just simply double click on it as soon as as soon as it changes to gold that means that it's been added so i'm not interested in that so close it and just like that you have it and here i've got your toolbox your toolbox is the same as the one you saw previously on meta trader 4 trade is where you see all the open trades your account balance your equity your free margins and if you're making profits or not you can also right click to add common like more columns like call like comments your magic number percentage your swap your market value id or your ticket number and so on and so on so i'd like to add the comment section so that you can see that i'm trading with my man of work on a day-to-day -day basis and your exposure your history this is where you see all the closed trades um afraid uh let's see and you can also add under common and if ever like you want to customize your period you can customize your periods like that to see today's results and so forth and so on and then here you've got the news your mailbox and so on and so on and so on and this mailbox this is where the broker uses in order to communicate with you on a day-to-day -day basis and your calendar company alerts if ever like you're from a company or something like that but those things are not really that important but What's important if ever you're using automated trading is your experts. You see under experts right there. So under experts right there, you also have a general, everything, each and every mistake that's going to be happening on your terminal is going to be happening and reported in real time under general. So without wasting any of your time, guys, you can also add multiple charts. Like right now, you see we have AUD card. You can also add your Zao USD into the chart as well it will open and at the same time if you want to see what kind of time frame it is in just go to view just go to toolbars it's on the standard setting your started lines have already been shown but your timelines they are not being shown yet there it is there is your timelines and if ever you're also looking for the those timelines or you want to change timelines you can just easily change through there that's how you change your time frames and if ever like you also want to go ahead and change another time frame it's also an option just right click into a chart and just go to any time frame that you want and if ever you want to fix the view there it is you've got your shift to the end or you can right click there's shift to the end as well so guys trading forex is really simple you just need to familiarize yourself with these things and just get comfortable with it and over here we've got your algo trader you'll see when we start setting up the system, we're going to be talking about all these tools here. And there's more that I haven't touched. I just give you the tip of an iceberg. So, guys, without wasting any of your time, it's your boy Peter. Subscribe, hit that like, hit that notification bell. Engage us in the comment section. And let me know what you guys think about this video. Without wasting any of your time, signing out.